Courtney here, Megan the Makeup Artist, and welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing this fun, colorful, blown out, smoky fall makeup look. That was a mouthful. <laughs> So I use a few of my favorite palettes right now. I've got two of the Jaclyn Hill Vault palettes and the Urban Decay Born to Run palettes. I'm using these today for this makeup look right here. I know it's not your everyday average fall makeup look, but I love it. It turned out great. Oh my God. I was just sitting down, playing with my colors, swatching them on the back of my hands, getting really messy and dirty, and just playing with all a bunch of colors to see stuff that I liked together, what I didn't like together, just to come up with some more fun, colorful makeup looks and put colors together that maybe I didn't think to put together. I don't know. So you guys tell me what you think about this makeup look right here down in the comments below. I want to hear from you guys. So if you want to see how I got this fall makeup look, go ahead and keep on watching. If not, I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Much love. All right, so today I'm super excited to do this look. I'm not sure exactly how it's gonna turn out, but I wanna do something colorful today. I've been doing more like natural or like soft, you know, simple looks lately. And so I was playing around with my colors and I've been itching to do something like fall and colorful and just, yeah. So I got my two Jaclyn Hill palettes right here, the Armed and Gorgeous and Ring the Alarm. And I've also got my Urban Decay Born to Run palette to see if I wanna use some of these colors. So we'll see how it goes. First color I'm gonna go in with is the color Agent right here on a, what is this, JH30 brush. And I'm just going, oh, my eyelids look creased already. All right, hold on. I went and uh, did makeup this morning, so excuse my hot mess of a face. I didn't redo it. And apparently my eyelids wanted to crease. And I'm just gonna go ahead and fluff, fluff, fluff <laughs> this all over the crease. The M504. I'm gonna go ahead and take the color Alert. And I'm just going to slightly put this a little bit lower in the crease. now on a mm, even smaller brush, the M507, I'm going to go in with the color Framed right here. And I'm going to focus this in the crease. So now I'm going into the Born to Run palette. I'm gonna take the color right here, Wanderlust, on a flat shader brush, a nice little dark green color. And I'm just going to focus this right here on the outer corner of my eye. Same brush, same side. I'm gonna go ahead and go in with a little top secret. And I'm just gonna kind of put this in the center of my lid. Put the brush around. I'm now gonna go in with the color Excess. And this is gonna go in our inner corner. In this color, I'm just gonna kind of pat and blend into that green. I'm gonna go ahead and take that framed color on a definer brush and line my waterline. And then still taking that color framed, any more defined brush, and I'm just going to buff it out.
taking the JH40, I'm gonna go back in with the color agent. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to smoke out the bottom lash line a little bit more. Now I'm gonna take a little bit of Guilt Trip right here on a different flat brush. And I'm going to go ahead and highlight the inner corners down here. And to tie that green in a little bit more, I'm gonna go ahead and take the color Jade in the Stila Smudge Stick and wind my lot and line my waterline, okay. All right, so I'm gonna pop on some mascara, maybe some lashes, and I'll be right back. All right, everyone, so that is it for today's tutorial on this colorful fall makeup look, dramatic, I love it. I love it when I'm able to just sit down and play with color, even though it's not like an everyday wearable color. I mean, it kind of is for me. But you know, so I don't know. I don't know, I just felt like playing with color today and it turned out great and I love it. Oh my God, yes. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. And if you like these videos, if you feel like it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. Don't forget to subscribe if you wanna see more fun makeup looks for with your glasses, without your glasses, a little bit of other stuff here and there. Go ahead and subscribe, so. Also, don't forget, I still have some cases for sale on my website at blushstudios.com. Don't forget to pick up your case. You can put your glasses in it. You can put your makeup in it. It's a great little travel hard case. I love them. I also have some t-shirts still for sale. I still have a few. Um, so don't forget to pick up your much love t-shirts also. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for all of your support. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Much love.